What's up everybody? Another Arcade Talk coming at you. Hope you're having a great morning, afternoon, evening, or night. Wherever you're at in the world, hope you're having a great one. Please smash that like button to help the video out. Okay guys, we're here at the at Games 4K to do the last pack for the updates for the flipper lag improvements. So this one here has the three star tracks. We've got Deep Space Nine, Discovery, and Calvin Timeline. These ones, all three look really good. Go ahead and hit play. Play all three of these. I just want to kind of show you what they look like. The flashing light. Uh, just kind of scan over the play field on all three of them and then uh, do the update and then kind of come back and see if there's any improvements. These ones here are pretty good though. Um, you might see a little bit of graphics improvements, but they were pretty good. There's probably not gonna be a whole lot, but there's Calvin Timeline. So there is Discovery. Kind of pan down. Trying to get the whole play field. I mean, like I said, these three, man, I mean, the railings all look good. The graphics look really, really good. So, I mean, I can't see a whole lot of improvements on that, except for the, you know, of course, the flipper lag. You can see there's flipper lag. I mean, this is when I hit. I mean, there's a pretty long. So there is Discovery, looking pretty good. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see if there's any graphics. It might be a little bit cleaner, but there's the Space Ace 9. Even this one here, you know, there's quite a few railings on there. Railings look pretty good. The other two, they didn't have much of railings, but the railings on here are like really small on this one. But, okay, there it is. Cardassian hey. support is dropping for the Alliance, Captain. Definitely see the flipper lag there. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go ahead and do the update. There. We hit enter. Uh, the current version is 1.7. Go ahead and hit update. The latest version or the new version is 1.11. It's going to take up 1.09 gigabyte. So it's a decent size, but there's three tables in there, so it makes sense. Go ahead and hit update. So the update in this one here is, of course, you've got improved input latency, which is your flipper lag. Uh, Deep Space 9 flipper lag was 126.57 milliseconds. Now it's down to 80.77 milliseconds. Discovery was at 125.67 milliseconds, down to 78. 0.67 milliseconds, see 78 is right in that range with the Magic Pixel tables. Then uh, Kelvin timeline was 127.67 milliseconds down to 85.83 milliseconds. So the best one is Discovery. Okay, and then we have improved audio latency. Enhanced support now offers improved audio latency, providing a more responsive audio gaming experience. And then now we have Flash Drive X support. You can now download Star Trek pinball tables to a flash drive through a USB port. Improved tournament participation. You no longer have to beat your top five score to participate in tournaments. And then select a faction. Players can now use the plunger to select a faction at the beginning of a turn. Oh, that's awesome. That's really cool that they added that. That'll make it a little easier to do. So there are, there are your improvements for this Star Trek pinball pack. And remember, guys, until they update all these Zen Studio tables, if you go from a new table back down to an old table and then go back to a new table, you're going to have some ball stuttering. So make sure you turn off your machine and reboot it, and then that will fix that ball stuttering. It did happen to me uh, yesterday. And I turned my machine off and it did, it, it fixed the, the ball centering. So it does definitely work to turn the machine off and then back on. You only have to do this until all these 
Zen Studio tables are fixed. We got what, three more weeks? Okay, we're at 98%. It's almost done. This one took a little longer, but it was a bigger uh, file. Okay, uncompressing the file. Okay, update is complete. Back out of here. Okay, now you see we've got the green X, we're good to go. Go back in tables. Okay, we'll start off with Deep Space Nine. I'm not gonna play all three of these, I'm just gonna show you the table and then try to do the flippers to see if they are improved. Uh, I can't tell if the graphics are improved. I would have to do a um, before and after. It looks really good. Of course, <laughs> looked good before too, so not sure for any uh, graphic improvements yet. Oh yeah, the flippers are definitely more responsive. Definitely can tell the improvement on the flippers. Graphics I can't really tell. Okay, here's Discovery, looking good. See this one has this has one small rail right here. Um, there's a little pixelating going on there, which I don't remember seeing before. This one here, the flippers are definitely louder than the last one we just did. Definitely uh, can tell the flipper uh, lag has been improved though. Big difference. Okay, and then the last one is common timeline. Yeah, so now I see some pixelating on the rails, so they definitely did something to the graphics, but I mean, I can see some pixelating in here, in here, a little bit there, a little bit in that turn, and then up, up, up here as well, but. Okay, let's play one here. Well, look at that. Flipper lag improvement, man, is awesome. Huge difference, huge difference in these. Let's say we definitely got used to the flipper lag. Got two balls locked. Get out of the, get out of the way, Captain Kirk. Get out of there. Whoa, I guess you can't do that. <laughs> Man, that ball just wants to bounce right out every time. Hey guys, a little bit of gameplay of that one. Definitely can tell the flipper leg has been improved. They look great. So there you go, guys. There's the Star Trek 3-pack. But uh, let me know what you think about the flipper lag improvement on these three. They look really good to me. You could definitely tell flipper lag has improved. 
it's almost simultaneously when you push the button. But uh, yeah, if you liked the video, please smash that like button for me. I appreciate it. If you're new to the channel or haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button. Turn that bell on so you don't miss any of my future videos. Until next time, I will see ya.